What is up everybody and welcome to Slime Rancher. I know I haven't made a video in months, but I'm back. Just finished up for the semester, so I decided I decided to uh start up with some more games. So, first off, we're gonna be playing some Slime Rancher. Uh it's early access, I think it's in beta, I'm not sure. But basically, you ranch slime, so you can sup suck them up, like so, and then you can shoot them out, and place it into the uh, corral. That's basically the point. You can breed different types of slimes, and then you farm their, like, something, I don't know. And then you can uh, sell it and make money, and you can do stuff with the money. So anyway, that's part of the game. So let's uh let's play some of it. Let me boost the audio a little bit. Every time I play a game I just always have it super quiet. Because I'm usually watching TV or something while playing a game because I have no attention span. Uh see we get carrots here and we can get the fruits here and when we feed that to the slimes they'll uh drop their Jewels. The precious, delicious jewels. Ew. Now I do want that. You need, like, uh, nighttime or you need, like, shade to be able to farm those slimes, and. Well, we don't have the money for it, so. We'll just ignore that for now. These are the things, the plorts. That's how we make our money. So let's collect a bunch of stuff. Ooh, yeah, that's what we want. Uh, let's get rid of the blorts. These cats are going the uh, cat slimes. That's how we're gonna make our money. We're gonna breed cat and rock slimes, and we're gonna make lots of money from it. So let's run back because our inventory is very full. I'm just gonna drop off the normal slimes and why oh, they not go in? Go in. There we go. Oh, <laughs> it shot right out. Oh well. Um, how much does a new one cost? Two fifty. All right. So I'll put the cat ones in there for now. When you breed two different types, they'll grow super large and then they'll just be able to jump out. So we'll keep it small for now. And I think the cats eat meat. Yeah, you see the top right, it tells you their diet, so. We gotta feed them chickens and stuff. And they eat it, and they poop out the blort. So, let's go and get some more money. I actually, how do I have another one in here? I thought I tossed them both. Oh, I guess I accidentally sucked one up. Let's also drop off all of these carrots and fruits because we want to just grab up all the blorts we can and all of the rock and other stuff and there's just lots to do and not that much time there is a day night cycle but it's not like anything scary happens at night so we can just continue on our way you can die I mean you can see I have health and some slimes will uh, attack you, and you die, but you just lose the day, which is no big deal. I haven't tried like the five day rush mode. It sounds interesting, and I might try it sometime, but for now we'll just play normal mode so I can get to the uh, indigo quarry. I think it came out like a month ago, but I just haven't gotten around to playing it yet, and that's what we want. Rock slime. Let's get a bunch of them. And as you can see, we are almost dying because of the big pink assholes. I don't think the uh, big pink large rock assholes. That's the technical name for them. Oh wow. We're actually getting very lucky getting all these uh, cat and rock slimes. Because you can breed them together and you can get both like the um oops <laughs> you can get both types of their blorts which uh, sell for a good amount 
early on, so. We'll pick up all these rock lords right now. That way we can uh, feed them to the cats and make them into big cat things. Yes, that's, that's the technical word for it. Big cat things. <sighs> Man, it's so weird. I haven't done any type of like YouTube recording and it's just weird getting back into it. I gotta, you know, re-familiarize myself with it. And relearn how to constantly ramble and have stuff to talk about and not sound like an idiot. <laughs> Which, well, I didn't know how to do that, you know, to start off with, so maybe we can learn it. You acquired a slime blort. Yes, thank you. I Oh, how'd you get out? Cats, they're always getting everywhere. So we'll toss the rock and the cat together. We need to make uh, higher walls so they can't do that because they're assholes. <laughs> but we'll leave them there for the time being. Let's see. Alright. Oh, wow, that's new. I d they didn't have like that turbo speed when I was uh, playing. It's pretty nice. So we'll feed the rest of them and then we'll suck everything up. I think we need 250 or 300 to get the high walls and then once we do we will be good to go for the giant cat slime monstrosities. So let's just pick up 350 or pick up the rest of these. I think you feed the rock slimes uh, vegetables. I I think that's what it is. Here, I'll go check. There, that's what we want. See the giant, large rock meat and veggie. Okay. Well, let's buy. Ah, I do need 350. All right. They'll still get out even with high walls, but it'll be less frequently, which will be nice. All right. So we need to go get some carrots and or chickens so we can get a bunch more rock and slime stuff together. And then we can get like an automatic feeder and oh, it'll be amazing. It will be amazing. The rest of the stuff, I don't really know. There's like uh music box. Like what does that do? It reduces the agitation. I have no idea. Maybe that means they jump less or something, but... Oh, well. There's also a bunch of upgrades you can buy, like a jetpack, and you can increase your uh, inventory collection size. You can hold, like, 30 or 40 of an item instead of just uh, 20, as we can now. So we really don't need to be picking up any more of these pink slimes because they're a dime a dozen. But we do need to get vegetables, and you see that big pink thing out there? It's a giant pink slime, and if we feed it, it'll give us a key, and then we can use a key to get to special places. Wow, that was a very round slime. <laughs> I was wondering what it was for a second. I thought it was like bubblegum or something. Alright. We'll pick up... These hens. If we get rock hens, we need to save those to feed the uh, giant cat slime, which is. Oh, hello. What are you? A lucky slime. What's. What's a lucky. I've never seen a lucky slime before. I actually have no idea what this does. Maybe if you feed it. Like, can I feed it? Oh my god! How the how the hell did it get up there? Uh, okay, lucky slime. Lucky slimes are a strange variant of tabby slimes that seem to be have a fascination with shiny objects. New buck coins. A lucky slime gobbles up any coin you can find. Uh, coins don't make for balanced diet, and a lucky slime will still greedily devour meat of any kind. In doing so, its body bursts with a shower of new bucks. Oh, sweet. Upon detecting your answer, the lucky slime will soon make a hasty retreat. Ooh, to capture 
uh, rancher risk. Uh, Lux Slime is known to produce blorts of any kind, leading. Okay. So, do you just get coins from it, I guess? I guess I got coins. I don't know. I might have had 130 before. I haven't really been paying attention. Alright. Stunny Hens. That is what we need. Um, let's get rid of these. Actually, uh, let's just feed. Oops. Did not mean to do that. We want to pick up some rock and tabby slime. But yeah, we want to pick up these. And we can just uh, feed these directly. And these are the bad guys. If you try to make, like, I think three. If you try to make a slime into, like, three of a kind, it'll turn into one of those. And is, ooh, a roostro. No, oh, dang it. You need the roostros to breed chickens, but I don't really need to breed chickens right now, so we're good. Out of my way! Out of my way. I need these carrots. Alright, well, I think that's... What are you, a normal chicken? What are you? Don't eat it! I need to pick it up. Actually, uh, let's just feed, because we're just going to feed it anyway. And also, uh, all slimes have a special food. And if you feed the slime, it's special food. It will give you uh, two blorts instead of one. A two for one deal. It's, uh, it's quite the deal. Oh, wow. Hello. Wow. <laughs> Bunch of chickens over here. It's awesome. We can get our uh, big rock slimes producing. I think there's just phosphorus slimes in here. Yeah, those assholes. They'll hurt you because they're a bunch of angry assholes, but they don't really give that much. Oh, yeah, and that's the uh, indigo quarry, which is the new thing for this game. It's the latest update. And I haven't been in there. I got to the uh, end game for everything else, but I never got to go see the Indigo Quarry. So that should be uh, pretty fun. And here's nighttime, and the music changed. Apparently, we're in Italy. Because that's exactly what it sounds like. Slime Rancher Early Access, version 0.3.0c. So let's toss all these in there, let's toss all the hens in there, and the chickens, and we get a bunch of big guys. Look at that, look at all that beautifulness. Yep, you'll see they'll get out, but we can just toss them back, right back in. We can get netting over the top so they can't actually get out, but they can break the netting. So there's really very little point. All right. We want to get auto feeding and also auto collecting. That'll be our uh, next upgrade. Let's see, 3:30. Is that enough for the auto collect? The auto collect is super useful. Oh, it's 500. They're both 500. Back in there. Uh, Aeronet's 425. Let's lower this audio. That's a little loud. Alright. It's so hard to collect them. Because you'll just get demolished like that. They'll be attracted to, like, their favorite food. If you, like, hold it out. So you can trick them away. But Oh my god. Alright. We'll sell this and then we'll go and get some more vegetables. For these guys, we can either give them uh, vegetables or chickens, so it's a lot easier to get vegetables, which is nice. Yeah, and you also see all the slime, glowing slimes, or whatever they're called. Phosphorus. Alright, I 
think there are carrots down here, but I'm not sure. Also, just pick up all the pink lords and we'll fill up the 20 while we're out. Because, you know, why not? <laughs> get some free money. <coughs> Alright, we just need to get a bunch of carrots. And... Uh, we'll just feed all the food to that guy. Just for the start. Well, just this food, I mean. Because there's uh, food that falls around this area, so... Huh. There used to be more. I know there's a crate here. <laughs> Feed chicken. Some fruit. Actually, yeah, let's just collect all the food we can. And then give it to that guy. Because that's just the easiest thing to do right now. Because once we get the key from him, we can go to the other areas and we'll get much better slimes that sell for, like... 40 each instead of just 8 for the basic. But apparently they don't want to drop any food around here. Cause there's just nothing here. Which is very cool. So, <laughs> I guess we'll just go back to what we uh, originally were going to do. Just run through, collect more blorts, make some more money. We can uh, start a garden. And we can make a bunch of food that way. And hopefully that'll help speed things up a little bit. So now we have the max number of pink lords. So we really just want some food. Anywhere we can get it. We can get water, but you need water slimes to do anything with it. So there's just no point. There's not much over here that we can do. There's like uh, a strawberry tree or a cuberry <laughs> and just a dead end over there so it's just really no point. <laughs> and we can just chuck these guys off into the sea or else they'll attack us like that because they're assholes. So yeah, there's nothing much to do until all everything grows back so this is gonna be very boring. But, yeah, that's basically the uh, basics of Slime Rancher. So, I guess I'll end the video there and start the next one up soon. So, anyway, uh, thank you everybody for watching. I'm back, finally. Hopefully, I'll be able to put a bunch of videos out this summer and do some uh, co op content as well. But yeah, thank you everybody for watching, and as always, please enjoy your stay.